folks, it's Terry Crews and Son of Beast here. This is the final game of Game 5 of Day 1 as we have the last matchup. The Suns are facing against the Timberwolves back in Minnesota as right now it's a 3-1 game. Minnesota, they are on fire right now. If they finish up in their last game, then they will be moving on to take on against the OKC Thunders. And this will be their part of a next matchup the number great C team, two versus the third C. Right in between the those two, as they will have the first start to have it all coming in. And now we start things off with the last commentary. I will have is Kevin Harlan along with the 2K Sports crew and David Aldridge on the sideline. The starting groups in between Devin Booker on Mike Conley, Ben Brook Bradley Beal with Grayson Allen, Anthony Edwards is with Jaden McDaniels. Carl Anthony Town is on Kevin Durant. The key matchups in the point forward position. And finally in the center is Susan Durkett on Rudy Gobert. Now let's get you things down and get started for the never game in game five. Wolves, Suns. Next. Here we go. Two K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA Playoffs. Hello basketball fans, you've got about 2K Sports as we get set to bring you an exciting NBA basketball game. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Greg Anthony as well as Brett Berry. And we'll be catching up a bit from the sideline with David Aldridge. Looking at the starting five for the Phoenix Suns. The big three for the Suns all on the four. Booker and Beal as the guards, and KD at the four. Nurkic is out there with Allen, and for the Timberwolves. The two towering figures inside for him, Towns and Gobert. The wing set for him, Edwards and McDaniels. And it's Conley in at the points. So many teams Greg look to run these days. It's refreshing, isn't it, to see a battle between half-court offenses. And to excel at that, you have to be extremely tactical. Minimize it's game time! Execution is key. Let's play ball! Now here's Booker. The pass to KD. And rebounded by McDaniels. And the Timberwolves with possession. Kicks to Edwards. Right side, Conley. What? Conley! He can make plays for others. Edwards moving it with conviction. And so it's Beal. He'll bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. The putback. It's Here's good on Nurkic. the putback. Such a big body down there. Nurkic battling. And just about a minute into the first quarter. Conley uh, the pass to go there. Timberwolves working the ball around. Him. Shot by McDaniels, no good. For Phoenix, they've gone one of three from the field to start this one so far. Nobody near Allen. Racing great out. assist by Booker as that one goes in. Just another part of Devin Booker's amazing offensive game. He finds wide open guys. Edwards passes to Conley. through. Down the first one. Still a solid point guard in this league. When Conley is healthy, he makes a considerable impact on both ends. The 
So we mix them both. Well, when he gets into a groove at the free throw line, it doesn't just last for tonight. This might be two weeks, two months, something like that. He'll give the pass to Durant. No good from outside. Let's it go from the wing. Cole Anthony Towns. Oh, this is my NBA Edwards. He's just too gifted. A shoe. Booker against Cup. Shoots from the elbow. Second chance effort. And Durant Kevin pulls it in. Great intensity from KD not allowing the defense to end the play. For Minnesota, they've gone 2 or 3 here to start out the game. And the kicks to McDaniel. If you're just tuning in, we play about two and a half minutes here in the first. Conley finds Towns. Out to Edwards. Outside Conley. To the inside. Gobert. And that Rudy Gobert. Assist ball to have Mike Cudley. And so it's Durant with it. They'll bring it up for the Suns. They trail by one. Deal against it. And the call on the shot. The shot the the and the line can't be a blitz. And just for the first goal top. First team top. Chance to contend with these Phoenix Suns. Two of the Phoenix Suns. For Bradley and Neal. I wonder how the team was in a losing situation in D.C. Now he has an opportunity to play and to do. Shoot two. First free throw is good. When we talk about Bradley Beal, still a phenomenal player, but someone who's getting older. And yeah, no doubt Bradley Beal, Greg, is a veteran in this league now and a guy that wants to compete for titles. So along with staying healthy, Bradley Beal is looking for something bigger. And both free throws good for Beal. Bradley Beal has been one of the most consistent scorers in the game year after year. He is an offensive machine. Conley is just to Edwards. It's Edwards on the wing. Lots at five from 18. No good that time. Well, he's a guy that count on to produce from the mid-range. He doesn't miss too many open looks from there. 15 feet away, and it's a Durant's got his second button. Off KD, just filthy from the mid-range, unguardable most of the time. Conley is surveying the D. Jaden McDaniels. A nice shot by McDaniels. This boy, Mike Conley. Seven times already here in the first quarter on the inside. KD passes to Nurkic. Back to KD. Kevin Durant. The top is this is the goal, Nurkic right? getting more and more comfortable in finding the open men on this team. Outside, Towns. That's it. Cool. Anthony Towns. Conley's got three assists in the game. And he's got such a great touch and feel around the basket. He made that reverse look easy. Now here's Booker. No scoring in this one. Perkic finds Allen. Now Durant. And then Durant. The jam. Ah, the slam from KD just getting to the rim for an easy one. Over to the wing. Gobert with the pass to Conley. And Mark Conley for three. Seven points in the game. Likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. Gobert against Booker. To the wing on the left. Here's Nurkic. Rebounded by the Timberwolves. Conley with it. He has seven. Passes it to Towns. 
Back to Conley. For Booker. And that Mark Conley. We'll see you. Sister, I call every time. Just back and forth. All night. Well, you can tell they really want to increase this lead. They can't keep letting them. Devin Booker. 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 Nas Reed, he's checked in for Rudy Gobert. Kyle Anderson comes in for Carl Anthony Towns. Alexander Walker, he's checked in for McDaniels. And Morris subbed in for Edwards. Free throw, good booker. So Greg, when you think about the Phoenix Suns, what do you think fuels them the most? I mean, the fact that they had a 2-0 lead in the 21 NBA Finals and lost, this team is really battling. Martin Morris! Just Morris being the quicker inside to get the high percentage look. Gordon, the pass to look. And the Suns miss again. You can tell he's not meant to be a good one. Do it. That's the ones. One fifty-two left in the first quarter. Conley against Gordon. Rocket six. Conley the pass to Morris. D2 from Anderson. Oh. Royal Anderson. Anderson that time shooting without any hesitation. Slow mo getting one off. Gordon kicks to O'Neal. Hands the shot to the wing. So far, both teams scorching the net. You gotta love it. Yeah, made for TV game here. Pace is great. Scoring is coming in bunches. And both of the teams feeling confident right now. Here's Gunn. The Suns getting the butt. Here, Alexander Walker. This guy, Michael Cole. Got here in the first half. Walker the pass to Gordon. Eubanks with it. Funded by Reed. Morris against Booker. Outside Gordon. And a great assist by Booker as that one goes in. Ooh, that three-pointer right there hurts. The former Indiana Hoosier really can bury those threes in bunches. Pass to Anderson. And there's the pass to Alexander Walker. Back to Anderson. Timberwolves passing it around. Lots of room. Rebound by a Kobe. The defense better tighten up on the mid range there. Much, much tighter. You expect him to make every single one of those. Read the pass to Morris. And he uses Our the Keith Morris. 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 Assist ball. Nuts and breathe. He crossed inside in the first half, guys, and, and it's paid off. And a slender first quarter. Minnesota Wolves. 25. Minnesota's looking at the tournament. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And this has been a fairly close game through the first quarter, and we'll see what happens here in the second. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Timberwolves. How about the ball movement so far? I mean, the unselfishness, everyone here just playing for one another. And that can be infectious. Uh, whether the defense is inviting these shots or not, they've been great in the mid-range. And so, producing from there, that bodes well. Towns and Gobert hold down the post for them. The wing set for them, Edwards and McDaniels. And it's McLaughlin in at the point. That's the thought to begin the second quarter for the Timberwolves. Booty, Gobert, Edwards. Edwards got three assists tonight. Suns trail by four. Here's Beal. And the layup falls. And that's how you average 30 a game. 
Beal scoring with the bump. The Timberwolves shooting 71%. All in all in this one, they've been brilliant offensively. Gobert, the pass to McLaughlin. And the three off target. And Joel will bring it up for Phoenix. To the paint. Here's KD. Second shot opportunity. No good. Shot missing. Towns with the defensive effort. And now we've got some time to check in from the sideline. You got for us, DA. Hey, Kevin, thanks very much. You know, Kevin Booker has a take on load management. He says, I'm not a part of that. I spend a lot of time in the summer making sure my body can take that load on. I want to be out there doing what I have to to help the team. That's how I've always been. And I haven't lost sight of those kids up in the stands that might be seeing me for the first time. Yep, back to you. I like that perspective, DA. Thanks. Pass to McLaughlin. Here's Gobert. Rudy Gobert. Rudy Gobert. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's Does it matter where you're from, a break, your background? You got to have game, right? Kevin, it's a beautiful thing. Some of the teams were in the NBA, others were a world away. Either way, when you get here, Rudy Gobert, assist by Anthony Edwards. Others involved. He does it time and time again. Nice to play with a point guard that takes pride in playmaking and makes you move around just a little bit faster to get open spots. And Lucas is no playing with this kind of aggression on that end. There aren't many better at defending. Gets it to Gobert. Nick Daniels with the ball. Working on Allen. What a three, Edwards. Rebound by the Suns. And Durant, here we go. Kevin Durant's good. And Zobiel with the assist. This is well, how sudden Durant can be with that attack. He sliced up the defense. They were up there. No way for the pass to Edwards. Better than giving up the layup. You want to go in there and use the hard foul. They did it there. That's aggressive attitude defensively. Good point there as it goes. So dynamic with the ball. Durant showing his versatility with that dish. Last season, GA, the Suns trading tons of picks, plus good young players, all for Kevin Durant. And then this summer, Jaden McDaniels. They're going all in, constructing a super team. Try and break Phoenix. It's first in the entire Phoenix on this time. Their first time out of the game. And this shows you what a superstar KD is. I mean, the NBA world is stopped when that deal was made. Yeah, you just shift the access of the league. Look, you have this elite scorer, this unbelievable all world talent. And when he gets on a roster, I don't care where it is, all of a sudden you have championship aspirations. Gonna have to watch out with that one here because there's a lot of them. Kevin Durant is just trying to let settle down the flow. They're making this offense a lot harder than the challenging is. Yeah, the uh, payback is just all these they did, but they have to do some a little bit like a little foot technique. Not even be on the ever call. Better to make a difference. This is what they have to do. Get that one in there and try to stay focused and right in between. That's what they don't do. They don't pick it up that really well. Gotta have to find out another way if we can get through it over and over again. Let's see what they do if they have another response. <laughs> Closing it on four minutes play here in the second quarter. No bear with the block. That's the times. That's Call Anthony Town! This one, Anthony Edwards. Hard to bump him out of his rhythm. That's the Dorkich. He gets it to Durant. The 19 foot shot and the rejection by Town. Suns ball. Suns making a change. 
change here. Well, he's Booker's champion. One, Devin Booker. Off the inbound pass. It's rebounded by Towns. Uh, for him, it's harder to miss that shot than it is to make that shot. I think he was anticipating a bit of a bump there. Oh, Anthony Towns! Four points in the corner. And I'll tell you, offense comes really easy to Big Cat. Booker looking around. Outside, Beal. Shot clock at six. Allen outside. Shoots over McDaniel. And shot clock violation. Violation. Two holds ball. So the finish over the kitchen changes. Three evenings. Chad Dems for Gobert. And it's Mike Conley in for Jordan McLaughlin. And for the Suns. Two holds. No more 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 two Right there in a rhythm offensively, really cooking. And the opposition is helpless to stop them right now. And the effort never stops for him. No easy shots when he's on the floor. Well, it's about the defense, man, and that's what guys feed off. He gives the effort down there this is at all times. And if that's the kind of lead pass we've come to expect from him. Conley with it. Now guarded by Nurkic. Conley kicks to Edwards. Anthony Edwards for three! Conley's got five assists tonight. And so good off the bounce. Edwards working on his shot off the catch and it is paying off. To the middle. And the pass Josh Okich. That's the kind of pass you want there. Work the ball around, keep it moving, try to get an assist on every bucket. Outside Conley. Here's Edwards. Great D that time from Nurkic. And so it's Durant with it. He'll bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. They trail by one. Hell show ball! No one has possession. they will have a jump ball. And it's the Suns with the ball. One on one here. Here's McDaniels. Cheating! McDaniels! That's a son! Charles Reed with the assist. And give him a free run to the bucket. Oh, you're so right. No question who has the momentum now. Execution for the pace. That's a bad turnover that simply was telegraphed. That's a oh, Guys, very good job getting himself in close enough that he can just tip it back in. Well said. Those kind of plays in the offensive pass can tell the story sometimes, can't they? So the Timberwolves call their first time out. And coaches looking to seize every advantage, maximize every possession. Well, I feel good as a coach if we make all those adjustments, pull the right strings. That's what they love to do. So it seemed like it's, this is pretty a close game, right? In between those two, a 42 41 game. Come on now, this time. As we get this thing over, and we have a halftime show coming up, that's right, we have is Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, and Sean O'Neill. They'll be checking it out with the first half on. And we'll be seeing them pretty soon once the first half has been completed. Get you all covered in there, and we'll find out who will take a chance to drop it in there for a little start to win it all. Problem is the key, but hopefully, might be the Wolves who are going to be looking at setup in there. Might be running it back. You may never know. After the show's coming up, after this. Alexander Walker comes in for McDaniels. And Monte Moore subbed in for Edwards. Eubanks, he's checked in for the Suns. The pass to Anderson. Kevin Durant with the rebound. Durant's got six rebounds here tonight. Booker against Hunt. Booker the pass to KD. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Timberwolves have gone 8 of 15 since we began the second quarter. Excellent shoot. Mark Hughes, Morris. That kind of looks like a ball. On 
that they want. The defense Does has to prevent the ball from getting into that sweet spot. Here's a Kogi. A putback. Great positioning on the putback. And those second chance points really mm -hmm. become mm -hmm. almost like bonus points when you can get them. On the next to Anderson. Inside. Nice ball movement by Minnesota. Reading the pass to Alexander Walker. Five to shoot. Fourteen feet away. And the Timberwolves take it. Alexander Walker. Back wide open from range. Big mix-up. Booker the pass to Okogi. Back to Booker. Here's Ubex. Guarded by Reed. And the rush to Reed. Okogi. That's nice with you there. You see that pass. You make the feet before the defense has a chance to react and that opens up a, a much better opportunity to score. And Anderson gets to Conley. This is it to Reed. The three from Anderson. And the last shot of the bus. He has a go out. And some good. Minnesota Wolves, 46. Timberwolves, 21. 45. With David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Carl. Impressive start for you. What's the mentality going into a game like this? Um, just being aggressive. Uh, really played like really played well at all the first half and stuff. We're missing all of us are missing a lot of easy money. We're missing layups for us as pros. So uh, second half we make those layups, uh, it should be fun. We'll see if you stick to the script. Thanks very much, man. Back to you. Thank you, David. We'll be back after halftime for the start of the second half momentarily. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello, basketball fans. What a pleasure it is to bring you into the 2K studios again. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jeff Smith. Nobody had an answer for Mike Conley in the first. He had nine points, five assists, and two rebounds. And uh, Kenny, what did you see out there from the Timberwolves? The passing is what kept the offense rolling. The communication has been tremendous. Guys are working as a unit and not as individuals. They've got to beat that kind of ball movement in the second half. And over to Shaq. What did you think about Phoenix? Well, I thought the one bright spot was the effort on the glass. Several times the momentum was sliding, giving a time to rebound. Mm -hmm. Strong work on the glass is key because that's how you string together a series of big stops. And that's a wrap. With the third quarter approaching, we now send you back to Kevin and the crew. You've been watching the 2K Sports Halftime Show. In that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. We've seen Kevin Durant really having a great game. Yeah, through the first two quarters, he has been the offense for this team. Yeah, he's, he's shouldering the load right now and looking really comfortable while he's doing it. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. And Phoenix, look at who they've got on the floor. The big three for the Suns, all on the floor. Booker and Beal as the guards. And KD at the four. Grayson Allen is up there with Nurkic down low. Allen. And you know that's going to be goaltending. Allen. Goal so that's a good basket right there. So close to getting the block there. You want to put those calls because you'd rather have a guy playing aggressive instead of playing safe. And so it's Conley bringing up the ball for the Minnesota Timberwolves. It's a one point game. Pass to Edwards. Now, Gobert. Kick out to Towns. Over KD. Carl Anthony Towns. And not even three quarters out of the way. So many lead changes. The fans, guys, are getting their money's worth. Heck, I should have paid to watch this with his money nail on. Booker, right side. Action coming off the assist from KD. 
Durant's got four assists in the game. The finishes like that are pretty impressive from Devin Booker, who we know is a great outside shooter. And here is McDaniel. Six points for him. Towns gets the pound. Launches a three. Mike Conley for three. I'm impressed with Conley's scoring ability here. He's an alert guard who understands how to attack the defense. And now the latest from our reporter, David Alder. Thank you, Kevin. The transfer of the Phoenix Suns last season to North Partnership ended a tumultuous chapter for the team. And Let's go, Wolves! The new Let's go, Wolves! made the trade for Kevin Durant last year and for Bradley Beal this summer. It's a great roster, and the Suns' $4 billion sales price reflects the sense that this Phoenix market is one of the sleeping giants in the NBA. Kevin? Oh, I agree. On the rise, David, thanks.
Look at up in game number between hockey and NBA and NBA to NHL. We've got the first two games as the Jets take on against the Avalanche and Canada Slipes entry. Then following over the next game as we go back to NBA, it's the Celtics facing against the Sixers at TD Garden. Then the next game is the Bucks and the Heat at Pfizer Forum. And finally is the Oilers versus against the team Mobile or against the Vegas and Team Mobile Now the Oilers Underway. Now let's go back to the game. Now Alexander Walker, he's checked in for McDaniels. And Monte Morris subbed in for Mike Conley. And the Suns here with a different look. Eubanks, he's checked in for Yusuf Nurkic. Chris O'Neill comes in for Kevin Durant. The Kogi's checked in for Al. And it's Gordon and for Booker. Great finish from Gordon in traffic. You like to see the smaller guys operate down low as long as they're patient. We're seeing problem. And Eric Gordon is the one on this team. He's a terrible on this team. One shot. Yeah. Well, it's amazing Eric Gordon, Greg, can attack this game offensively still and have an impact. He's ready as soon as you put him in the game. And so many coaches value that kind of consistent approach from a bench player that can be a pro. by one. Here's Morris. He's got six. Here's Edwards. Seven points in the game. And then getting aggressive and creative. That was finding ways to create space on the floor. Here's Eubanks. Running by Reed. Second chance shot. And that's two points on the way. Eubanks got his second best. Really strong rebounding on the team. He really gets the easy put pass. The pass to Reed. Of the night. That's just tremendous scoring instinct. So fun to watch him work in the half court. Pass it to O'Neal. We've got 128 left in the third quarter. The layup missed. But the D's so tight on him, it makes him alter his shot. And an easy chance turns into a tough one because the defense is swarming. Anderson passes to Morris. Nice ball movement by Minnesota. Here's Edwards. Six on the shot clock. Everybody. Edwards. Edwards got six points. He's the ball. Great strength and body control from Edwards. Out center ball for the contact. Here's Gordon. Reed. Edwards. Out of bounds. So he's ball. Take possession. Edwards defending. Here's Eubanks. Kicks it out to Gordon. Back to Eubanks. And that one is never us. Remarkable pass off that pick and roll from EG there. He might have been able to take that shot, but wisely threaded the needle. Here's Alexander Walker. Played in with a nice touch off the goal. Alexander Walker. Walker's got six points. This team really feeds off of one another in terms of their energy. At least in the second half they have been. The first half wasn't played anywhere near this intense. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Here's Beal. He's got eight. Just four to shoot. Fires for three. Good on the 
triple. Beal's got the game tied up here for the Suns. Beal loves getting a little wiggle room and then great rhythm on that three. Tells the end of the third quarter. We're going to start off for just 65. He's right back here. He's going to start off for 65. Just one quarter left. It's a tie game. Next one will win. Will we Wolves move on? Or Suns force the game six? Be right back after this. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter form. Well, there's a way to break down the defense with the handle. If you can do it with the pass, prime example of that right there. It's the fourth quarter, everyone. I can't hear you. Make some noise. Plays the point. Edwards plays on the wing. McDaniels is out there with Reed. And it's Gobert in it. So that's the one for Minnesota. Inside, six feet out. And it's good. No, sir. Reed. And the two will three by two. That was the right call. Get it. McDaniels. Trust the most. Yeah, whether it's teammates or the coaching staff, hopefully a combination of both. But. Gets close. He's getting the ball. Minnesota shooting 61% from the feet. Showing some marvelous touch out there. Gobert against Nurkic. Out to Conley. And stolen by Booker. And now the Suns. A fast break. Over Conley. Booker. Good. Cutting into that deficit now. Well within striking distance. They're just much sharper out there. You can see guys getting in tune. It's not about playing harder. Sometimes it's just about playing smarter. Has to go there. And words against Beal. Here's Conley. Go Mike Conley. How about that move? Conley kind of adjusting around the contact to get the finish. Here's Booker. A rebound by the Timberwolves. Down the kick to Reed. He dishes it to Gobert. Outside Conley. Pass to Reed. Stolen by Durant. Minnesota with the rebound. Conley's got six rebounds now in the game. Nick Daniels with the ball. Now guarded by Nurkic. Back to McDaniel. And the pass to go pick. Pocket six. And here's Edwards from the arc. He can't get that one to fall. The Suns have gone one of five from the field here in the fourth. A lot of this is just the one make. So they take the lead. Eight you know, points for Allen. Went right down to the wire here. Still anyone's ball game. Yeah, and after all the energy both sides have expended, both teams still hungry for the Conley. Conley! Is this a boy? Yes, we! My Conley just knows how to play. Booker against Conley. That's the Nurkic. Operates well in traffic, but still, that's just a tough play. Nice pitch to get inside. 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 Nice pitch to get to make the adjustments and keep the ball in front. Well, looking at the stat sheet, I can just see here tonight, sharing the basketball, the stat that comes up most is assists. So sometimes you have to look for your teammate. That makes things happen. Get done. You throw good. And talented. Something too so on the court. Is the is it's focused. Crawl up and he The refining of his shot mechanics and the sustained level of engagement. Towns, he's checked in for the Timberwolves. And Edwards drops him off. 
Suns trail by three. Booker outside. Kicks it to Dorkic. Three-pointer on the way. And rebounded by McDaniel. That's it, Bulls have gone three or four in the field goal attempts. It's getting things started here in the fourth field. He's standing out of the right town to be the super bear. When he plays like this, he makes the defenders feel uncomfortable. Two shots. Shoot two. First one falls for him. There might not be a guy with more heart than Carl Anthony Towns. From his words to his actions, this is a guy who cares about the game and his fellow players. as he gets both of his shots. A big fella with the ability and confidence at the free throw line is something that every team wants. You don't have to make those late substitutions. Keep your big guys on the floor. Nurkic, the best guy, Allen. It's going to be a goaltending oh, ball game, so they'll count the bucket. That's a very close call. I'm sure he thinks oh, it's a clean block. The first was on the way down. Minnesota calls timeout. Things present themselves throughout a game. Teams have to adapt on the fly. And timeouts are a wonderful opportunity to just settle in and recollect the thoughts of your entire team. Not just the guys playing, but the entire team. Definitely for the entire team. Why not? It's still coming down toward the wire, folks. 4 3 1 left to go. 75 72 game. Suns trail by three, and we'll get you back soon. Resumes back to Kevin. And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with David Alder. Hey guys, here's what Chris Finch went over with his guys during the break. With the game in the balance, the coach was calm in the huddle. His main message execution. He told his team to make sure to remember what they talked about during shoot around. We've got a great ending in store, guys. Thank you, David. And that is okay. the worst. This is the ball. Beal continues to be that guy where he opens your eyes with his playmaking. Beal with the steal. All by himself. And the jump by Booker. The guys here in the fourth quarter. Still a close game. Instant classic, fellas. This one could come right down to the last shot. Very pretty. Earth works. And so it's Beal who bring it up for the Phoenix Suns. They trail by one. To the inside. Nurkic. And finished off by Nurkic. Nurkic getting up there and waiting that rim. For Minnesota, they've gotten four of their six shots to fall so far here in the fourth. A pretty nice efficiency there. The Phoenix foul. Nurkic shoots. The second Bristol foul. The team foul. Guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown. Live for the Minnesota Wolves. Rudy Gobert! Defensively, I mean, coach. And along with two shots. For possession and then converting those second chance opportunities. Well, if we add another thing to it, it's about the Take urgency the they've Take played the with. I mean, you look two at shots. the eyes of these guys, they're focused, wanting to get up tempo, and that's helped them score on the fast break. And the first one at the line is good. His role on this team: rebound, block shots, and look to score near the basket. And go, Bear drops them both. The Suns have gone 6 of 13, so just above 46% on their field goal attempts are in the quarter. Booker the pass to Allen. Back to Booker. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call. Baseball's first goal of five. Might as well score one for points. Booker shot 90% from the free throw line during the regular season. 
Yeah, I just saw this. Goku, 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 Goku. Out of line for two shots. So he hits both free throws. Timberwolves trail. Nick Daniels with the ball. Now guarded by Nurkic. J.D. McDaniels. Ten points for J.D. McDaniels. This by Mike Hundley. You think one team's got something going, the other seems to respond. He sends time up. You look at Michael Pounder, what a contribution. I don't think he's in a complete groove right now. I don't think they can stop him all together, but what they end Looks like the Wolves are having a little bit of fun time right now. They're ready to go face on against the next team seed who are still home. Hopefully they can try to see what they can do if they can have that status. Well, let's hope they can. The next one will be on its way soon, so there's only a couple more, couple more time to go. We're down to a final three minutes in the fourth quarter. Catch you all there soon. The NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports is brought to you by Starry Lines, American Express, Don't Live Life Without It, and by Sour Patch Kids, Sour Sweet Gum. For a moment to reveal the New Balance Player of the Game, Kevin. And now let's present our New Balance Player of the Game, Michael Conley. And in terms of his shooting, this has been one of the more accurate performances you'll ever see. I mean, he's been in constant motion, creating a lot of good looks for himself. But but still, even when you're wide open, you expect to miss some of the time. Now, that has not been the case here tonight. This guy has made everything. here in the second half. Yeah, it's such a clutch shooter. I mean, he lives with a big shot. And when he's rolling like this, watch out. Edwards passes to Towns. Good. Call Anthony Towns! And the Timberwolves lead by one. And this is why he's a go-to option. Towns enjoys getting the chance to come up big for his team. Booker outside. Pass to Durant. Five on the clock. Rebound, Minnesota. Two minutes remaining in the very issue. Two minutes. 158 left to play here in the fourth. At the Towns. Now here's Gobert. He hits Edwards on the wing. Pass to Gobert. Three. It's hauled in by the Suns. KD's got rebound number seven for him tonight. Booker's Devin Booker. And that's why Devin Booker still has shooting. the ball for moments mm -hmm. just like that. Yeah. And so it's Conley bringing up the ball for the Minnesota Timberwolves. Well, there with it. Now guarded by Booker. Nick Daniels with the ball. O'Neal's there. Nurkic with the steal. Here's Booker, and the double double double. Double. And Booker, that's the guy you want in the clutch. Timberwolves trail by three. Here's the pass to McDaniels. Nice ball moved by Minnesota. Towns, the pass to McDaniels. To the left wing. Conley up top, defended by Booker. Here's McDaniels. There on the triple. Phoenix is gone. 
one of three from outside the arc since we've reached the fourth quarter. Passes it to Nurkic, back to Booker. Launches it. Again, the miss by Booker. Minnesota with the ball. It's a three-point game. Pass to McDaniels. Back to Edwards for three. Anthony Edwards for three! Timeout, Phoenix Suns! And he nets it. The timeout called the Suns. It's tied at 86. We've got 28 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Well, this is a close battle range. While the Wolves still have two timeouts left to go, I'm thinking that there's going to be an overtime game. Do you think this will happen? Uh, <laughs> I, I think there might be an overtime or may may not be. I would say there should be no overtime. It's already like a late game, man. I mean, what do you have to expect right now? Well, <laughs> I, I, don't, I have no idea if this will happen. Because this is what they don't really deserve. Trust it for anybody who cares. Nobody really wants that one out there. They need to make sure they have this one counted out. Well, let's see. Let's hope that this one comes in right now, if they do or don't. All right. Let's find out if it is. We're under 30 seconds, so we'll see how this happens. Post game is underway right after this regulation period of the playoffs. Games. Redecision starts now. Everybody under three. Make some noise. We got 28 seconds left in the fourth. And a sort of calls timeout. They trail by three. There's 21 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Guys, what do you think? And if you can get a three, shoot it. Otherwise, get the quick two and a foul. Don't force something up. You gotta be smart here. that the Devin Booker made a half-court shot 
That was sick. If you seen the last game, just like George Niang did, it had to be the same thing, but different quarters in between. All right, as we close things off, let's have a look at the total statistics in between. 51 field goal range for the percentage for 43 points, and only 100% 100 for Minnesota. Phoenix Suns is only a couple of them. Madden was 24, 60, 20, and 21 for all of them for Phoenix Suns. 20, 34 assists is put up there for Minnesota Wolves. 15 defensive rebounds for Phoenix Suns. 24 to Minnesota. That puts in for defensive rebounds. 4 steals for Phoenix Suns. 7 blocks for Minnesota. Unbelievable moment. 2 turnovers for West Phoenix Suns with 14 fouls between. 10 dunks with Phoenix Suns, 6 and time position with 17, 03 for Minnesota. So that will do here, folks. I hope everybody's enjoying right now. And now it's time for three star players of the game. Peace, all yours. All right, thank you so much. Time for three star players of the game. I'm going to give this one off to all of them. But this is what they have always expected to see what this comes up with. Anthony Edwards finishes off with 16 points. Two rebounds, seven assists, and one steal. Six out of 12 field goal range, two three pointers, only one dunk, and 30 performance effort. I know he's doing really well, but let's hope that he does more in game six. Now, for number two, I'm going to send it over on the other side of it. Still the Wolves, but this calls for Mike Conley, the new balance player of the game. 16 points, six rebounds, 10 assists, six out of six field goals, two three pointers in between. 38 performance effort, and turned out to be a little great than you know, but happened to be there just like that. Just well enough to take from here. But the unfortunate has ended up from the game 5, and they have put it over and finished it all. That means number 1 goes to Devin Booker. 22 points, 2 rebounds, 5 assists, 1 steal, 9 out of 19 field goals, 1 3 pointer, with 7 of them and then 35 performance effort with three dunks, and just made a half-court shot at the end of regulation. That was no way of how we could have done better with that result. And that's going to do. The Suns take a win on the road in Game 5. Now it's a 3-2 series. They're coming back in right now and finding their way if they can get a Game 6 win to tie the series up. And before Game 7, this is where it has to be, like, in there or not. You may never know what you're going to pick. So that wraps it up, folks. That's the end of each day. I hope you all see you all again for tomorrow for another game. As the first one goes to hockey before basketball. And then basketball go back to hockey for tonight's game. Right in between of those two, another double header. It's all great and fantastic. Why not? I guess it is so too. So thank you all for tuning in. For those of you who have always subscribed to my channel, I appreciate your support. And we could have, could have done it with all of, out of your accomplishment. Thank you so much. Peace out, folks, for a while as the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports Style. This is Terry Crews and Son of Peace thanking you for watching. Bye-bye, everyone. See you next time. Good night, folks. If you don't, Somebody will.